Again, today is Ash Wednesday, marking the start of the Lenten season for Christians in El Paso and around the world. New at 6, ABC 7, Stephanie Valle visited La Purísima, the Socorro Mission, where a replica of artwork depicting Jesus after his crucifixion has transformed the community. Michelangelo's La Pieta can be found in St. Peter's Basilica in Vatican City. It's closely guarded and it's behind glass. But you can have an up close and personal experience with the statue, an authorized replica, right here in La Purísima in Socorro. It means a whole new chapter for our community, for our valley, probably even for our city. It, she's one of a kind, and we happen to be privileged to have received that gift. La Pieta's installation is a landmark moment for Socorro. We had not really been hospitable to tourists for a long time. Our hours were very short. More often than not, the mission was closed. Church volunteer Magda Maurera said the addition of the Renaissance masterpiece next to the altar came as the church was transforming its mindset. Little did we know how the hand of God works here. We are now seeing hundreds of people on any given day. That's what I was hoping it would do. That's my goal. People that will never get a chance to go to the Vatican will be able to go to see the Pieta in their community. Richard Stewart and Esther Fresca Stewart are behind the donation. They met and married in Socorro in 1969. <laughs> they were back in town for last month's unveiling. In tribute to my parents and in tribute to the area of Socorro, the people of Socorro and the community of Socorro. I truly believe that these are pieces of love and energy and if, I, if we can place one there and that in that church, it's a miracle for that church. That's what I believe. Now, we're in the holiest time on the Christian calendar, a time to love and forgive. Things those who've been touched by La Pieta believe it embodies. There is the Virgin Mary sitting there with Christ, but she is not bitter. And I think it just shows us to forgive. It's a challenge to our faith. So it, it's, it's a very, very powerful symbol. And I think gazing upon her takes you many, many places. It takes you on a spiritual journey without leaving the borderland. Stephanie Valle, ABC7. It's beautiful. Richard and Esther Stewart funded 11 replicas directly, but say their money will help create more than 100 more. Only 112 will be made. One is in California. Richard told ABC7 he's working on installing one in a church in his hometown of Rome, New York, and in the Pope's summer home. Those are expected to be on display by the end of April. If you have